Hello everybody and today I'm here with Mixed Training. Let's have fun and let's go! Hello everybody! Hi Karma, how are you doing? How are you? Mm. Let me fix everything to be okay. Do you want to play a rapid game? I mean, if you get me in free play, then yeah. I'm not playing anyone. My challenge. B5, yeah. Black's fine. Maybe six, I guess. Yep. This I don't know. <clears throat> mm. Perhaps like G six. Okay, yeah, Rook eight works as well. Looking forward to the Chrono World stream. How are you, Draconic? Hi, Pookie. How are you doing, guys? Twenty five fifty is fine. We're doing laundry and dishes and stuff. Okay, nice. Nice bookie. Get D five, I don't know. I definitely like White's position from White's perspective more. He'll play yes, he do play D five. Nine D eight it just feels like an odd move, you know? Yeah. I mean, at the very least, why can't just stay and then I don't know, play queen d3, the d of bishop a7, bishop a5, should be fine for sure. Black has g6, but then there's like bishop a6, bishop d5. So, yeah, I would take and queen d3 if I'd be white. Okay. Yeah, I don't know what White's thinking so much about. Perhaps they're thinking about Queen D3 and then D takes C, but I don't know, it just feels right. So this, and then there is double threat. Black's forced to go here. I go Bishop H6, Rook E8, and no Bishop D5. It looks, definitely looks fine for White. I'm not sure why White doesn't want to do it. Or maybe they want to and they're just thinking. There is D6, Rook C1 as well, though. So, yeah, I'm not sure. Okay, Bishop B5. I find out. Yeah, but should be five is severe looking move, I'm not gonna lie. Uh, but it has the idea of DTXC and then Bishop of five skewer. So it's fine, I guess. Yeah, it takes D. There is no bishop of five now because there is knight e6. But perhaps white has rook d5, queen e6, bishop of five, and queen e8, queen of five. Is rook d5 just winning? Queen c6, rook d8, queen e6, bishop of five, and it takes. Queen e3, queen of five, straightening mate, and straightening the rook, and queen b7, just like rook d8 as well. I'm not sure about it takes D as black. It feels like it just loses. Queen a7, but queen of 5 anyways, no? Yeah, black is getting destroyed here. Interesting. Interesting. Queen of 5, game over. Oh my goodness, white missed queen of 5, what? Or, did, or am I missing that? By the way, queen of 5 is 13 mate, right? And the rook hangs as well. And g6, queen c8. Oh my goodness. And now black has 96 and still rook d7. 
it's still not clear, but wow. Queen b6, but queen f5 still, come on. Come on, play queen f5 white. With after queen of five, there is queen g6, queen c8, queen e4. It's just an exchange, not a whole rook. Or I mean, there is bishop h7, queen of five as well. So I mean, I'm I'm pretty sure white still c completely crushingly winning. But okay. Thinking so much when if I feel little, little, such a human move. I'm surprised they didn't play it one move earlier. Huh. But it kind of has to hurry up though. If a lot of great moves, they just have to choose one and stick with it. The problem of queen five. There is no problem. That's a great move. I'm not sure why 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 white is thinking like a minute about it. They did one move earlier as well, so there's no no problem with it. But I don't know why it's white not playing it. Now here they did. Okay, yeah, but now queen g six. And last move there was no queen g six. So yeah. Now if take c eight, take c four, it's just gonna be an exchange for white instead of a whole rook. Yeah, they take, take, steal is good. One exchange up, yeah. It could have been a rook up though. A queen e6. Yeah, there is queen e6, it's still totally winning for white. Do not play rook d8 though, because bishop d8, rook d8, queen e1 important, king h2, queen e5, queen e7, it's fine. It's even though white's black better there as well, because there is rook of 8, queen e6, I don't know, just, just play queen e6 now as white and just chill. Queen d4 now is a good move, I think. Forcing a queen trade. How you doing, Aurel? Yes, takes, takes. Now, yeah, but white is just winning bishop d6. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Rook b6 or f4, f5 works. d3, I think, is a little too slow. Why, why not play rook b6 when there is no a5? Rook b6, please! So no a5, no counterplay. Yeah, they're both sitting blundering quite a lot. I mean, now black, of course, is still cry. Okay, rook d8. That's game over. Go on, rook d8, rook d7. Rook d8, rook d7, please. Yes, okay. So that's all they care. What's happening? He miss. I mean, he got fine position from exchange slav, but then he messed up. Then it's Mr. Prizrak, he's from Bleach, yes, so hello, good luck. Yeah, game over. Now, rook a7, rook a6. I'm still a little bit worried for white, but okay, hopefully. Hopefully, they realize the advantage. Grunfeld. Yeah, why it's just winning, but it's still not so clear how to win, you know. Takes, he's from delicious country. Yeah. What's going on? What is painful? The position for black in the last game? We only get like two rating. Yeah. But I think if he would care that much about trading, he most likely wouldn't play in this kind of tournament, I think. Interesting, my opponent offers a draw. What was this? Did, what? On move 10, he offered a draw? Okay, no draw. <laughs> it's still unclear. Take it to become Geary. No. Okay, nah, now it's winning. I'm a little afraid that white will throw. 
d6, rook d3, king, uh, do not take d6, play king b3, a4, yeah. A, B, I mean, it's going to be a tree now, but it's game over. B, are you sure? Yeah, okay, it's winning. <laughs> Why it feels so 100%? Yeah, I don't think so, hopefully. Instant plus 450 alone. <laughs> yeah. Okay, why didn't throw that? That's a nice, nice endgame knowledge from White. And my, now my opening is sinking. King c7, king b6. King c7, king b6. King c7, king b6, king a6. Okay, now, okay, my opponent made a move, I thought he will not make a move. I think I'm just gonna castle. Just keep it simple. It's king e6. Great skills from white. Very, very cool. Oh, let's go bishop h5, g5, bishop g3 should be fine. Yeah, well, I played it pretty well, let's say. Maybe could have done a little better with queen of five. Wow, okay, this guy is fearless. Okay, bishop g3. Right now, g5 didn't do much. Knowledge went, yeah. Yeah, white were like completely winning, but they had this queen of five. <coughs> one move earlier. Why zero zero zero? It's already it's zero one zero. But why not queen of five immediately? Was there something I missed? No. White made a mistake at the end, King C4 was a mistake. So technically it's 0, 0, 0. Because who cares about a mistake which didn't even give advantage back on move 6, yeah? Yeah, maybe. Why did he think, why didn't he find Queen F5 though? Mm, Knight D7. Okay. Um, let's go look up D1. A great game, yeah. Queen f6. This guy really wants a draw. Maybe cheat against AGM. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Maybe I should have played queen g4 with ADS of 95. <coughs> and then h4. Yeah, I think I'm going to go for it. <coughs> it's not queen e2, but I don't know. This is just way too tempting. I mean, 22 95s can win against AGM. I mean, AGM played quite badly, you know? AGM didn't play too well. AGM just uh, blundered very, very badly. <coughs> And I mean, it was very hard for white to throw. Jim played too simply, yeah. He played first of all, he went for the exchange slav. I am and I'm doing good, what about you? I'm <laughs> good, how about you? I'm doing good as well, thank you. <laughs> Removed it, yeah. <laughs> uh <-huh. clears throat> yeah, Queen E7 a good move. If that doesn't work. <clears throat> H4, there is F5. And queen h5 there is, I mean he has f4 which feels wrong, he has knight f6 and queen g6 should be alright, but I don't know, I don't want to allow him to play f5. Hi Darko, how are you doing? It's almost 15 minutes and you haven't used a catchphrase yet. I hope I won't need to use it. I hope I won't need to use it today, um, but we'll see. I think I'm gonna go knight a4, knight c5, but I'm not exactly sure or should i just go queen e2 and then like f3 i don't really don't want him to play f5 but yeah queen g4 wasn't a great move we didn't want him to play f5 i guess um because yeah he'll get f5 now the question is should i play like f4 but then he has f5 queen of 3 knight f6 knight e4 for exciting times yeah it's really an interesting game yeah it will be <sighs> what will happen? We'll see. Hmm. 
I really know an impact play this f5, f4, and perhaps even f3. So I guess I gotta play like queen e2, f5, f3, and f4, bishop f2. Yeah. Yeah, queen g4 was the greatest move I've played. <coughs> Maybe I should have went bishop d6, queen g3. So my bishop will like forever be on d6. It would be on d6. Okay. Huh. So I don't see what else. So let him play a five piece tempo because maybe now he won't play a five, you know. So we'll see. Hmm. I do think in the middle game. So many things to consider. To be honest, I don't know. <laughs> I don't recognize what I consider step by step. Should have probably went e4, queen e4. And queen e1. 95, 95, 97. Yeah, so basically, I'd go e4, probably, then queen e2. Or like queen e1, then 95, 97, 90, e6 things would be fine. Now is <clears throat> Agent Witch. F4 is like interesting, but yeah. Alright, I'm gonna go F4. That gives him E4 square and blocks my bishop, but I'm not sure we'll see. Yeah, probably Dark Home. <clears throat> What's going on with my wisdom? I'm not sure. F4. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. Definitely not the move you want to play. Closing your bishop from a great diagonal. But preventing f4, f3 stuff, I think it's okay. Though it's annoying that I give him e4 square as well, but I mean, he felt like he had to be done. Can you explain me f4 move? I don't know. His idea was f4, so. <laughs> I didn't want him to get my bishop with tempo with f3 ideas, so. Yeah, it's definitely an odd move. Not, I'm not super extremely proud with, of it, you know. Uh... Now I'm thinking about like knight a4, knight c5. Uh, or bishop a2, so knight e4 is without tempo. I mean, yeah, I'm, I'm queen e2 and f4 felt so awful to make. Probably they weren't the best. Uh, Alright, I'm gonna go knight a4 if something I take knight c5, I guess. So do you want to open fl? Nah, just, just preventing f4 from my opponent. Stonewall structure, yeah, somewhat. Yeah, but I'm definitely this. I mean, position from this, from here, and here it was so much different. Uh, here was like a very, very happy, uh, cool position, and here is like position which hurts my eyes. <laughs> uh, but okay, it is still definitely playable, so we'll see what will happen. Okay, G4? What is G4?
Okay, bishop h4, if takes, takes f open g file. If not, then like hg, queen here and there. And if h5, then knight c5, if queen f7, knight c5 as well. g is an odd looking move, you know? Feels weird. Yeah, he takes, but then I take. And then we, I mean, we both have open g file. But I don't know, with my bishops, I think my attack is gonna, hopefully going to be stronger. But we'll see. Queen of seven. Maybe I should put my knight on c. No, maybe I should take. Uh, but then again, yeah, I don't know. I'm thinking I thought knight five so this, but then he has knight four, so I'm not so sure. So maybe I should take a fate and then play knight five. But then it will be like super equal. So then I'm thinking I maybe should play king h one. And yeah, I think that's what I'm gonna do. Because queen h five, I just take knight five. I'm fine. And if knight five, first of all, I have knight five. Knight four, I have knight five. I can take the knight five. I can go like rook g one, double up, rook g one, something like that. So yeah, I think king h one is a fine move. Okay. <sighs> Ninety four, perhaps rook g one and an eighty five. Like auction here too. <laughs> no, I mean I don't know. I think I calculated too well here. I mean, yeah, it was maybe not awful, but okay, could have done better. Ah, uh, but yeah, things. I think I'm gonna go rook g one eighty five. Not knight c5 first, yeah, I think I'm gonna go rook g1, so there is no like bishop f6 immediately, no knight g3 tricks, and now my idea perhaps is just taking a knight c5 or something like that. Uh, we'll see. Yeah, this. Now the question is should I play knight f5 or should I take a knight f5 so he'll never get my knight away, pretty much. I think I'm gonna take. I'm not sure. Just looks more. More human because takes takes and my bishop is kind of restricted by his pawns, and this bishop is doing nothing. So if this bishop would go, this bishop would be restricted. So yeah, I don't know. Would feel quite wrong to do it. So yeah, let's go on bishop e4. Uh, knight c5 now. Just somewhat like pinning his queen, so it cannot really go anywhere because. One of these will hang. So it actually now now it looks quite fun to play. Um, yeah, now I can like double up on G file or maybe even triple up, and yeah, it's gonna be interesting. Yeah, queen of five. What if I just play queen D four? Right, threatening mate. If takes takes both the pawn hangs, uh, both the pawns hang, and then it should be fine. I think. I think I'm gonna go queen G four. And then rook G four, ninety six ideas, ninety seven ideas. Looks good. And if he doesn't take e6 things anyways. So I think no matter what, I'll win a pawn at least. Told you if he will, it will be interesting. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, now I'll take with the rook. Taking with the pawn was an option, but I kind of want to have this open g file. And if bishop of 6 important moment, I have 97 win in an exchange. And he's also getting low on time. And I have rook g7. I have 96 as a threat. And I, oops, I have the Oops, I have... I have this, I have this, I have that, I have this, I have this, I guess it's an idea, it looks fine. So I think I should get a pawn at least. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna take and then rook c7. He has rook b8, but then there is knight d6, I think. Or I can just take and then take and then rook, rook e7. Okay, here isn't this just, just like no? Nah, I mean, it's kind of no. But wait, here I just take g seven, right? Yeah, I think h five is a blunder. Take six and like knight f five before, and it should be winning. Yeah, takes knight c five. Yeah, let's go b four. I think it's okay. King g2. And I can play on both wings. He like put a block here, get my king to h4, and one of these pawns is going to fall no matter what. Yeah, I think bishop d8 is a cool looking move, preventing a5 ideas like at all. Uh, rook b8, yes, sure, but then bishop c7, knight a6, and now it's just game over. 
of the passers. Yeah, I can have two and FH4. Yeah, I can have this and an FB6, which is unstoppable. Hi, Eloy. Now that both those pieces are off the board, I can mention, I assume, 94 bishop d4 was never scary. Yeah. 94 bishop d4, no. Didn't feel scary. Yeah, now it's this. Uh, this, king g3, king h4. And uh, game over, pretty much. How are you doing, Eloy? Making two. And then I missed a prisoner. Okay. Yeah, that was a good game. Uh, there was the moment where it didn't feel super smooth, but after that it was quite fine. And 91 viewers watching on Leeches, that's cool. I'm doing well as well, thanks. He's from Leeches, GG's. Yeah, I mean, I definitely messed up here. At the 97. I was plus 2. And then F4... I The advantage vanished. But I played 1-0-0, nonetheless, which was quite nice. Yeah, I didn't use the crushing advantage I had, which was plus one. Then it was slightly better even for him. Okay, bishop d4, actually, oh, and then knight f3. Yeah, but here I think it just worked, because knight f3, and yes, like b6, h5, yeah, that's why it worked. It's because you're on rapid TV, yeah, 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 yeah I know. But after queen f5, queen g4 was winning. So one nil nil, not the smoothest game, but quite fine. For 50 moves, one nil nil is pretty good. Yeah, I'd go for 94. F4 wasn't scary. I just go bishop here, and then F3 just doesn't give him anything. This is this, this. Yeah, I'm, I don't know. Bishop d4 didn't feel scary, but computer says he would be better. But then after queen d4, it was just crushing. Cool, now let's play Komodo. GG, thank you. Okay. Okay, let's go. D4. C4. Let's see, 3. E4. Apparently my sack idea wasn't totally bad, so I wish just in order night and I was accepting the sack. Oh really? Oh cool. No, but yeah, with the knight you ignore it. No, with the knight you take, but with the bishop. Ah, uh, then you play knight e4, so this and that makes sense, yeah. Okay, c5 is castle. Are you I am no and I and f m a Well, I don't know. Guys, how is it more correctly grammatically said? NFM or AFM? I mean, AFM is correct, but it just breaks my tongue saying AFM, and NFM is just so much, it feels more correct, right? What is correct though, guys? Let's go AC and a 95. That was a weird night maneuver. Why couldn't you just play 96 immediately? I don't know. But I don't mind some free, 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 free tempos. Let's go Queen D2. Yeah, all right, guys. Yeah, it felt correct because even though, yeah, but, but a feed the must, right? Yeah, because I don't know, it just breaks my chance saying an AFM, yeah, an FM, yeah, yeah. Can you see position is totally drawn? Uh, maybe not. I pronounce F, so it's semi vowel. That's true. Like, so cheat went away, something, yeah. Uh, let's go bishop d3, so you something I take e4. Yeah, now I thought I can maybe even go... I think I'm going to go king d2 and perhaps take rook c1, rook c8. Rook c1, rook c8, king of... Let's go h3. Yes, king of 6, which looks scary. Just go for it. Uh-oh. Fm, yeah. Makes sense, zero thanks. <laughs> Because, like, it felt, F NFM felt more correct, you know? But, like, I wasn't sure maybe I was wrong. Okay. Yeah, king e5. Maybe I should have actually went king d4. Um, yeah. Now I should find a way how to survive. I mean, it's not that bad to just survive. But definitely not super cool as well. 
Just imagine things. <laughs> Let's see. Yeah, can you find this an idea? Uh, 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 uh. So unfortunately, I just messed that one up. Yeah. I think I'm gonna go like rook of d1, then bishop of one, and if e4, I have a check on e2. No, bishop of one, bishop e2 felt correct, but it felt wrong to take the square from my king. Now I'm gonna take and play king c3, and then perhaps b4 if b5. I go through b, but now it feels like b4 is quite okay. Not sure. You just need time norms. No, I'm not over 2400 and 2330. I want 2400 in blitz, but there's no B, B I am. There's no blitz I am. Uh, I know B4, but then there is B5. Take, take, look. I don't know, I'll go B4. It looks correct. Preventing B5, B4 stuff. This king. Where uh, <laughs> B I am, yeah. So can be two. Mm-hmm. Um I'm not sure. Maybe I just go like King B3 if take take. Oh, but then yes, E6. Maybe I just wait and if rook a4 go there and e6 just like now yeah, but then take it feels odd, but maybe I just wait do and do nothing. That's not written calculated. Ooh, what do you mean calculated? I mean, I guess how you play. I was thinking just to stand, and if takes, takes, and it's fine. Okay, for if king b3, this no idea. So, yeah, I think I'm just gonna go here, and if c4, still no ideas. Yes, this I thought I go king b3. This I thought I just wait, bishop f1. Here. Ah, and then e6. Yeah, makes sense. Let's do maybe something like that. Uh oh, am I? Yeah, how did I manage? I mean, it's still not lost, but I somehow am managing to throw the position, which felt unthrowable. Uh, let's go here, rook d2, I guess. Just like, oops, standing. Uh, now I'll go bishop d1, perhaps like a4 ideas. h5, now he wants g4. It's classical chess. Yeah, yeah. Uh oh. Hmm. Now bishop e2 just standing, so he doesn't have c3, I guess. Ah, but now when he played h4, it feels like it's fine now. Uh, bishop d1. Aha, uh -huh, this. Yeah, I messed up badly this game. Huh. It's a really bad this game. Yeah, king b2. He takes um, bishop c4. Yeah, that was bad. I did that look like that. It was drawn and I just let his skin to e5 and then I was lost. Okay, maybe he takes. I mean, he takes, but g2, unfortunately. Hmm. It doesn't even take the e4 pawn. Uh, guys, I have a small question. Uh, um, how often do you win against? I mean, now I'm winning. Excuse me, what is bishop of five, sir? What is bishop of five? Huh? What's he doing? What is this? Huh? Hey? Maybe I'll slip. <laughs> Maybe. I guess I'm gonna push and not even gonna bother taking the bishop. Well, hello, yeah, b7, exactly. Huh? What was that? 
not Komodo. I mean, I'm not complaining about a free win from Wolf's position. Thank you. But uh, what was this? Huh? How did that even happen? What? What was this? Okay, guys, that was even a 2600 blunders, yeah. Guys, everything was under control from the engine. As, as, yeah, everything was under perfect control. As you saw, you even didn't have to worry. Um, cool. Very cool. Yeah, so it was like minus 20 and then plus, plus 20 in one move. Well, that is some swindles. Uh, and it says I made zero mistakes, zero wonders, and zero missed wins. Oh, uh, Chesco is probably on something. I mean, I yeah, I definitely didn't make any mistakes. When from slightly better position, I got like worse position. Then I got dead lost position. Definitely no mistakes, no blunders. Right, I know, I know. Yellow c3. I should have found bishop c1 perhaps, right? Uh, bishop f1. So after c3, take and this, this, and rook a2. And now if he takes, takes bishop c4 doesn't work. And yeah, it's drawn. Yeah, but should you want to see blunder? But uh, no, but I mean, okay. First of all, I was surprised why didn't he take e4? I was miserable five. Okay. Yeah, so I was, I was fine. I was definitely fine. Uh, I was better. Then I misplayed. Yeah, probably I gotta. I just had to take the pawn. I was a little bit worried. Did you think, you guys? Very, very cool. Yeah, then I was slightly better. I had to bring my king to d4. King d2 was bad because he's king at d5. And then, yeah. So, d4 to take accuracy for me, 80 to 7 for him. 0 running moves for each of us. 1 rate move for me, 3 for him. 22 percent for me, 18 for him. Uh, 16 excellent for me, 15 for him. 9 good move for me, 7 for him. 8 book moves for me, 7 for him. 16 accuracy for me, 4 for him. 5 mistakes for me, 3 for him. 1 miss for me, 2 for him. 0 balance for me, 1 for him. Him. Well, that was cool. Yeah, that was interesting. I mean, I'm, I'm still in shock. Like, it feels like it's not real. Can you even activate the bishop? Is what do you mean? Seems like a mistake too. Thank you, coach. Uh, if I now, but then take, take, take. Where does the bishop go? I'm just blocking all his pawns. I have bishop c4. I'm not worse at all. I don't know. It was, it was everything under control. Unpassant, yeah. Unpassant, bishop c4, rook c4, king d5, I'm fine. What is the move here, though? Rook c4. Is it perhaps? Uh, perhaps bishop c4. No? Perhaps then bishop e2. No? Perhaps then it's rook c3. Yes, okay. And then he was still drawn. Uh, good one move. Not rook a1. Perhaps then just takes. Yeah. Sorry for inconvenience. No, you're not excused, just go. This is this, and it was still quite fine. I had to go for bishop upon, I guess. No, I actually haven't. Oh, oops. Yeah, I mean, just come to spoil everything. Okay, it was rook a1 with ideas of bishop d1 and 4, I guess. And if king d4, I go rook d1. Oh goodness me, oh my goodness. Take, take, take. Can have two, this, this. Yeah, and then it would be equal ish. Uh, but then rook eight, bishop b1, mistake, go for bishop f1. This is silly things. That's true. That is pretty true. Wait, but wasn't it bishop f1? Yeah, now it was much more fun. And then, uh, oh my goodness, I even made the correct move. How? Why do you say this wasn't good? Yeah, and then the bishop of bishop b1, I blundered c3. This is this. 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 This is b5. This. And a brilliant move. Brilliancy. I know which Eskom didn't say that bishop of 5 was a brilliancy from him. No, but like, okay, I would understand bishop e6, okay? 
Like, okay, he has bishop c4, but bishop probably just blundered and everything that was dumb. Okay, so I played middle game 90.6, end game 80.9 accuracy, and opening 90.8. He played 91.5, opening 93.2, middle game, and 72.4, end game. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, so everything was under perfect control, guys. You didn't even have to worry. Yeah. Aha, so that's an interesting battle because probably after Queen C5 you will castle. Uh, but then I have rook e7, rook d7. Um Queen of Five. Huh. Queen C5, Lonside Castle, Rook E7, Rook D7. Rook e7, rook d7, rook d7, king d7, rook d1, king c7, queen e. Welcome to see where everything's under perfect control. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think I'm gonna do this, 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 and then take the rook. Cool! Yeah, those pretty nice. Oh! This feels cool. I don't know, it's a goofy soul, but maybe I can somehow trap his queen. Interesting puzzle. No, but that doesn't work. Eh, I'm not sure. I'm not sure guys any thoughts, any ideas perhaps. And <sighs> <laughs> no, rook a eight, but there is queen a eight, unfortunately miss check. I'm thinking about king e five because I don't know what else can be correct, so we don't he doesn't escape. This, but there is resist, so king e5. Yes. Knight e4, there is queen b5, bishop d5. Feel thrown. Um. Um. So maybe it is check, king g3 here. This can afford bishop f3, rook h1. Yeah. Let's see. Yeah, I'm trying, yeah. I gotcha. Um. Still ninety four. I don't know because there is takes. Probably yeah, it works. Yeah, right. Because takes there is kind of four in years. It takes. Yep. Good. Yeah. Yeah. Good point. I'm in. I I kind of kind of maybe may of may may not may not missed missed the uh, king of four with bishop of three, but uh, we don't care about that because yeah good point. Solve the puzzle. D takes here rook d six bishop of three. No, but then there is rook d seven, which kind of feels weird because bishop d two, e takes f b h one. No, that doesn't feel right. Then it's probably queen d three. So I still so I still have the pressure. Take take. Take, 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 take. Yeah, I think it's queen d3. No! It was rook d no, it wasn't rook d6. Uh, it was e takes f. No, it was queen d1. Oh, no. it was queen e 3 Yeah, it was queen e 3 And then not knight d5, it was bishop d5. Yes, and then rook d5. And rook d6, and it takes. Okay. Why not queen d3? Why not queen d3, sir? Because uh, after queen d3, he takes... and Oh, yeah, right. And now he has a bishop f4, and it takes this. It makes sense, makes sense. Oh, I think I've had a puzzle, maybe even this puzzle exactly, or at least something very similar. It makes me feel better about my own puzzle skills, it's in this one, like eight guesses. Yeah. H5 feels correct. So he doesn't have queen h5 ideas. Um, Because like when you thought there is like rook c7 stuff, you know? Uh, perhaps they do not work, but they do not work, but, 
uh yeah what if h5 rook c7 king g8 this oops not that i can't do errors eventually this is queen d3 but then there is knight here there i don't know queen d3 this this it should be winning this queen dun 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 i'm gonna go h5 yes i can play king of eight i can play king g8 i gotta think a bit because interesting, instead of the king of eight, there is f6, and if takes, there is this, 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 oops, there is this rook h8, g8, that's winning. Has to be king g8, queen g3. Yeah, yeah, that was a cool point, king of eight, f6, that was very nasty, sacrificing the queen. Mm, yeah, so if I go here, then there is f6, and if I take, there is this, 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 and that is pretty much mate one. Yes, cool. Uh, I mean, okay, 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 okay. That was three moves. Uh, well, actually, probably even f it wasn't g6. Okay, <laughs> it was e4, right? That was like the easiest puzzle I've had, but I missed e4, so this I have g6, yeah, because there you have queen f6, yeah, okay, but I still got plus five. Interesting puzzle. Um, interesting puzzle. Play bishop g7. Yeah. Yeah. a6, high totally journal. Interesting. It's not a bad move if I protect the pawn, actually. Not a bad move. But I don't think it's the best. So maybe sort of king g8, king of eight. And you could play bishop g7. Yeah, king of eight, f6, bishop g7. Oh. No, but bishop g7, there is queen g7, I think. e6 is forcing. Yeah, I'm not sure. Hi, Jonathan Jesus, long time to see. How are you doing? As a blunder, yeah, queen of eight, yeah, sneaky. So I'm thinking it's either rook of eight, rook of seven, or rook f6 yeah uh rook f7 queen it ended then did it i was a joke ah okay 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 okay, okay. what's the difference ah ah i think i found the difference guys so i think rook f7 is better because after f3, I can take and rook e8, this queen e7 isn't made, I'm not sure. Rook f7 just feels my, makes my king more, more safe, it felt like, yes, it, it is correct. And I think it just rook f2, right? Yes, king, king c7, queen e5. Yeah. And rook f6 didn't work to f3 or what? Or is, was it something? Ah, there is queen e7. Yeah, just keeping the control of that square was important. Hi, Tablechik, are you? But I've saved that pawn. Yeah, yeah, that is true. I blundered that pawn. Very, very important pawn. Unfortunately, I blundered. Mm, now it feels like it's queen g3, no? Feels like it's the only move, pretty much. If I want to win, because bishop of 6 ideas on that stuff. And bishop d4, there is bishop e3. Yeah, okay, it's queen g3. Now... Okay, that's nice. I... I mean, there is rook f8, queen f8, bishop b7 takes, which is probably wrong. Uh, and h1 to sucks, I don't know what to do. <laughs> yeah, okay, don't worry, take your time, take your time. Um... And a rookie one perhaps pinning the bishop. Yeah, it wasn't. It was bishop f6? I then take what is queen g8? What well, wait. If king h8 I mean if queen h8 rook f7, but king h8. And now rook a1. Okay. 
Okay, okay. It feels like it is one bishop d8. I mean, I have rook a2, but then he has queen e7, king g7, rook g5, queen f6, checkmate. Perhaps king h6, it's not checkmate after queen f6. a6, a6, I blunder my rook, unfortunately, or even mate after rook g5. So I don't think it's correct. Um, but bishop d8 feels very, very good, actually, not gonna lie. So I prevent bishop queen e7, then I can take a2. Yes. Now, per, no, but this there is queen before bishop d6. Perhaps it's actually bishop c7. I'm not sure. Or I just take a2. But after I take a2, there is queen before king g7, rook e3, so I'm not so sure. I literally don't care. <laughs> oh, wait, the rook, the rook hangs. Ah, the rook hang, hung. Okay. And take the rook. Yeah, I just missed the rook was hanging. I just missed it for a short second there. But yeah, yeah, it's correct. Oh, I think it's probably an ID4, no? Because bishop d4, I have queen c4 takes, I take. Otherwise, I'm a piece up, and if rook d4, I take. And otherwise, if bishop b3, there's 92. h6, h6, blunders, and the knight and the bishop. I don't think it's good, unfortunately, but I think knight d4. And my idea is to take the bishop. Bishop d3, I take, and bishop f1, I have, say... I'm not sure actually, got a thing there. I mean, I have g5. g4 take, yeah, and d4. Yes, and then take, and I mean, it's queen b4 most likely. So it's 800, let's go. So six correct, three failed. Pretty good puzzle solving today. You found another one that English speakers get wrong, hang and on. Okay, okay. Yeah, but that was a, a simple puzzle. I mean, it's hanging... No, I don't, yeah, it's very, very confusing sometimes. Yeah, 94. It was pretty simple. If this, there is g5, I think, right? I have bishop d4, I take the bishop on c4. And this, this, bishop of 1. Yeah, bishop of 1, g5. Yeah, that was a simple puzzle. And 3800. Ah, nice. Cool. Felix wants to join the club on chesscom. I didn't get uh, somebody want to join the club for 20 years, so you're more than welcome, Felix. So now let's analyze the game against Mr. Prezirak. 1 0 for me and 3 0 for him. Again, slide for open a plate. Uh, so it was Grunfeld, but then he got into some sort of exchange slav. Here he offered a draw. Uh, but I decided, yeah, g5 was very weird. He should have done this, then take, take. 95 bishop g7, it would be quite simple, but g5 this, 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 I was better, I think I messed up a little bit how I played, I wasted a tempo, could have played queen e2 immediately, here I'd go knight a4, and if f4 play bishop f2, and it would be fine, do not worry about anything, then knight c5 would be better, because after f4, then knight f6, g4, I got quite a good play, this is, okay, I had to take, and I took, now I'd go for b4, and then knight c5, it would be fine, because take, take here, he played queen 5 which was a blunder, he had to take d4. And then computer says apparently that, that, there's queen of 2, knight of 3, rook d4, this I have to suck an exchange. And after rook a8 he would be slightly better. Um, but computer says I had to take either b7 or e4, and after take, take play queen g4. So after queen f7, this is I have rook c, no, this I'm actually winning, rook c7. Bishop g1, there is rook f7 takes queen g1, I'm winning. And queen there is this, 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 this mate. Um, and, uh, yeah. So, he had to go for rook g8, then bishop g5 only move. Uh -huh, bishop b2, this, this, f5. Take bishop h6, take, take. King g6, this. Uh, and it would be pretty equal. But yeah, he played queen f5, I played queen g4, forcing the queen trade. This is, now he took the pawn. h5, which was another mistake, I took and then I took. Take, take, knight c5, this, I bring, bring my queen, I don't know, bring my king over. Uh, this is this, this is this, and then this, 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 and this queen g7, that was me. So, I played 1 and then I played 3 and 1. Not a bad game. Yeah, perhaps! Perhaps could have done better, but it was a great game nonetheless. Um, yeah. Okay, now let's analyze. Now, actually, let's not analyze. I have found another very cool position, guys. Uh, from uh, I found a very, very cool position between two players. Brought it over. Okay, thanks, Logan. How are you doing? 
Uh, so a cool position, white had their king here, queen there, rook here and there, bishop here and uh, there, right? Yes, and a pawn a2 here, e4, f2, g2, black had their king on c, queen g7, knight e4, no, rook d8, f8, bishop on c5, knight g4, and pawn b7, a6, d6, uh, h7. Uh, and the position was black to play. Let's, yeah. Okay, so it was black to play, guys. Uh, find, find the best move for black. Make a pulse so we can win rewards. Right, right. Uh, I'm gonna make a poll. A new poll. What does black black play here? Um. There is, uh, I don't know, I don't know, what, what is the logical moves? Knight c2, knight c2, rook f2, queen g4, uh, something else. I'll give you guys three minutes. Take your time. No, prediction, no. No, no, no. I'll make a poll. Thank you for the follow, my peace team. And you're still here in the fun. So yes, guys, that is a position black to play. What do you think is a move? If you think it's something else, let me know because maybe I tricked you and it's actually something else. So yeah, guys, I think and I'm gonna open. Let's see, so let's take your time. You have three minutes. Do not rush anywhere. Ah, uh, yeah. I'm trying to remember, who was it actually? So yeah, this guys. Let's see if more. Pe no, not not no people voted. I think so far. Did they? No, yes, guys, take your, t take your time. Take your time. Take your time. Hi, William. How are you doing? You're right in time for a position. You still have one and a half minutes. I would like to guess Ruka 5. Okay. Uh, uh, yeah, there is still one and a half minutes. Black to play. What is the best move you can think of? Something else. Okay, Lorgan is for Ruka 5. So, William, if you want to participate, there is a poll. So, yeah, feel free to vote what you think is the best move here. See, it's a bar, I think. I feel like C2. Okay, then, then, then vote. Okay, two people for something else. And if, and if you say something else, uh, write it down. Lorgan says Ruka 5. Not sure if it's the best move. But okay, yes, guys. So let's see, it's I think about a minute left. Uh, who voted something else? Let me know what you thought, think is the best move. Okay, it's very tight actually. So it's three for knight c2, two for rook f2, two for queen g4, and two for something else. Nice job, guys. Very, very interesting moves. So it's actually. Is my move legal? If so, yeah, your move is very legal, Lorgan. I wanted something else just because I didn't like any of these three extinct options. All right. Any lessons from a 2700? <laughs> cool. Okay, it's 3 for Rukafu, 3 for 92, 2 for Queen G4, and 3 for something else. Who wants something else? Let me know what the move is. And the time run out. Yeah. So we got actually three winners. I calculated rook of two, queen of two, rook of eight, bishop of four, and we got stuck there. Rook didn't see how white can survive. Yeah, so that, that's a very, very, very interesting. I said the rook for content. Okay. Yeah. So in the game, there was this. Uh, rook of two was another option. And queen d4 was another option. Um, so... Let me start with knight c2. So white took queen c2, uh, then rook f2, 
queen of two, this, and white took. The best move was bishop e6. What game was it? I don't remember who played it. It was some game I've seen online. Uh, bishop e6. And now, after king b8, white can take. And the position is pretty much equal. I think black che no black checks here, they check there, they check here, and then pretty much I think it's a repetition, king g1, queen d4. That would be a draw. White played king f2, but black were extremely low on time, and black found the best move, rook f8. The position is like plus one for black. King g1, queen d4. But after king h2, black decided they were like super, super long time. They decided to repeat the position. Uh, but, but, here they did a great move rook f1. So then after rook h7, I think it was queen e5. Yeah, queen e5, then queen d4, bishop e6, king b8, and then black has rook c1 takes, uh, takes, takes, king h3, black would be better. So, black would be better. And yes, they chill most of you, and viewers, welcome everybody. Uh, but, as we said, bishop e6, and it is equality. Yes, yeah, zero zeros. So it was a draw. So, 92, if you played 92, you got a draw, but you could have gotten better. Now let's go with rook f2. Rook f2, okay, king c2 just loses absolutely to knight b3, winning a queen, I think. Or maybe there is even better rook f8, right? Yeah, rook f8, white's even, black's even more crushing. So rook f2, king, this, we found out, wait, knight c2, queen f3, wait, gosh, uh, what line knight c2? Knight c2, queen f3, queen b2, rook b3, rook f4, rook f4, rook f4. Ah, knight c2, queen f3, king f3, wait, what are you talking about, I mean, what line? Let's see, two, queen of three, queen b2. I'm not sure. Uh, but pretty much, if rook of eight, yeah, rook of eight, that's winning. Uh, but on the other hand, had queen of two, rook here, then bishop of four. Yeah, I've seen uh, white can survive William. Yeah, that's good. White is lost. Uh, Iman got stuck. So if you rook of two, this is this. Let's see, two, queen of three, queen b2. Uh huh. Now, but yeah, let's see, two. Uh, the only move white survives is queen c5 apparently, and then king oops, king oopsie doopsie, here rook d1, uh, this, this, uh, takes, takes queen g4, rook d8, and then the position would appear something like that, and I'm not actually very sure if it's better or lost uh, one for black. It feels like so if with precise play it should be winning, but it's definitely probably survivable for white. I'm not sure though. So if you play rook f2, good job. You got a great position. Another move which worked is knight e2 with the same idea, pretty much. King d8, this, this, and exactly the same. So yeah. And there is a very brilliant move, queen g4, which is even better than rook f2. Black gets plus four position. The only move computer says is rook of two, but black sacrifices the rook. Rook of two. If king of two, there is knight c two, and king of one, rook of eight. That's mate and queen is three. I mean, you just take the queen, take the rook. You're just crushingly winning. So white has to take with the queen, and there is queen d one check here. Okay, rook of three that loses to queen d three or rook of three or queen e one. Pretty much everything. So black white plays bishop of four and rook of four. King g1, knight f3, king h1, queen e1, knight e1, queen e1, rook e1, knight e1, rook h7, a5, and black is winning. So guys, how did you guys do? It was a very interesting position. So yeah, black played knight c2 because they were low on time and they went got their draw. Uh, but, wait, why? Yeah, bishop e6. Yeah, bl black still would be better after bishop e6, like slightly better here. It's like a very small advantage, so. Rook f2, yeah, you would be better in that endgame. But it's still, ah, unsure if it is winning or it's better, let's say. Uh, then, yeah. And you, if you play queen g4, you're just winning a piece. So what's the point of queen g4? So then you sacrifice the rook. And then after queen f2, you get queen d1. Pretty much forcing white to do the only moves. Bishop f4, take, take knight f3. Then you trade the queens, but you are end up a knight up. And then you are just totally winning. So guys, 
Did you like the position or no? I did you like it? And now it's very winning for black. I mean, white doesn't have any sin at all. Brilliant stuff. Yeah, that was impressive. Mm. So, Queen G4 was the correct answer. I mean, thanks, Joseph. Like, that is that was actually a cheeky puzzle. Uh, guys, look, computer doesn't even see Queen G4 at first. So, Queen G4 is the correct answer. Nice position. Found a yeah, but yeah, I'm a new found. Computer doesn't see Queen G4. Oh my goodness. So we play Queen G4, you guys are better than engine. Impressive. So yeah, that's a very cool puzzle. So everything works, but now after like three minutes of thinking fights Queen G4. So let's say 92 is a move where you get slightly better position. You you have a force draw pretty much, right? Because you have this rep repetition. Um yeah. Rook f2, you, you get this endgame after all this stuff, and you perhaps are better winning, but queen g2, you're just crushingly winning. I almost missed it. <laughs> okay, so that was a inter very interesting puzzle. Mm, yeah, now let's analyze my game against life open and, and somehow, uh, wait, and uh, how is someone ever will play in 82 after queen c5? What do you mean? So the good in Queen G4, yeah. They should be Queen E5. I mean Queen C5 to Knight C2 or what? No, but hold on, let's check Ayman's line. He said Queen F3. Wait, wait, let me check real quick. He said Queen F3. Oh, but Rook D1. No, Rook D1. Queen B5. Rook d3, rook f4, queen f4, queen d3, that's mate. Great. Yeah, you, yeah, that's impressive. Queen f3, queen f3, that's correct. Queen b2, you're just winning. Though, computer said there is a better move, rook f4. So, you're forcing mate queen b5. Because here, after queen b5, white gets queen c4, and they somewhat... No, it's still mate. Yeah, that's just winning. Everything works. Good job. I mean. All right, let's analyze the game. Yes, we played quite well. G5 was an inaccuracy from him. He had to go for e5 and then take, 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 bishop g7. Uh, knight b4, uh, e takes d, knight c6, b takes c. E4, oops, not, do not take e4, and it would be a bet, slightly better because of a better position. Opposite color, bishop more edge. This took a d1, this, this, this. This, 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 that was small inaccuracy, white had to go for, I mean, white, now I'm talking, I had to go for, uh, rook c4, knight b8, knight a4, with the idea of stuff like this, oops, with this, and white would be better, knight f6, this, 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 yeah, I felt like g4 was inaccuracy, but it's okay, take, take, here, 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 uh, this, this, that was a little inaccuracy as well. Uh, I had to go for rook g2. And then this, uh, this, bishop h8. No, okay, bishop f6. Bishop f6, rook g2, rook, no, queen, rook g2, knight f6, knight e5. Um, knight e4, b4, knight e6 would be equal. Yeah. Uh, f takes e. That was a mistake, though. Uh, rook g2 was interesting. And knight f5 was a mistake. I'd go for rook g4 or rook g2 and it would be just completely equal. Um, bishop now. Nah, okay, wait, let's see. Let's computer sync. I'll read the chat real quick. Yeah, will you make some courses? I'm not sure. I, I don't think I'll be good at it, to be honest. Nice fun. That puzzle was kind of tricky, so the end game would be better for black, but I didn't see queen g4 stronger. Yeah. Okay, yeah, that was a very tricky puzzle. Because, like, uh, this puzzle was pretty much saying, okay, if 90, if you play 92, you want a slightly better endgame, right? Well, not slightly better endgame, but like slightly better position with this rook f1. And to be honest, actually slightly better endgame, yeah, right here. Uh, if you play rook f2, you calculate it deeply enough, and then you see that queen b1, you take b2 or a2, you're better. And you're just not sure if you're winning or you're just better. And queen g4, and you, if, if you've seen this rook f2 line, that's impressive. I didn't find such puzzle. Yeah, I was just watching some games and then uh, and then I just found it. It's very cool. Uh, yeah, so white had to do this. 
and then rook here. Why am I saying white? After this puzzle, I'm, I'm talking to me as I'm in third person. This is and then bishop h8, uh, queen d2, and it would be equal. Uh, so let's see, queen f5, that was a blunder from my open, and he had to go for a brilliant bishop d4. Uh, and then after knight b7, take, take this. Uh, no, wait, that loses. I play queen d4, this, this, uh, rook g8, bishop g5, uh, bishop g2, this, this, this. Queen f5, bishop h6, king h8, goodness me, help somebody me, please. I'm gonna go insane after this with calculations, variations. This is this, this queen g6, queen f2, and bishop g7 is slightly better. Ew! <laughs> oh, wait, I actually misplayed. No, okay, bishop b7, let's delete everything. Uh, bishop d4, uh, but then this I take, oops, sorry for minus ears, by the way. Uh, let's delete remaining knight d4. This knight f5, queen c3. He cannot take us of knight d6. Uh, this knight e4. This this queen e5, and position would be equal. Okay, but after queen d4, yeah, slowly but surely I won a pawn. Then I won this, then I won that, and then slowly but surely I promoted the b passer. Uh, bury the b pawn, and then I made it. He went on the Mr. Prezrak. Okay, GG's. GG's. Yeah, so it was a cool game. And it was a pretty cool stream overall. Got 3800 back in puzzles finally. Then great game against Cypher Open. And a very, very interesting game against the Sockfish, you know. Uh, very, very, very interesting game against Komodo, I mean. Not Sockfish. Very exciting. I was dead lost, but then he blundered everything away. Uh, everybody, don't forget to join the Discord and let me sound well stream and well stream. That was fun. And also a very cool puzzle. Glad you guys liked it. And yeah, I think I'm gonna wrap things up. Thanks everybody for watching. Uh, bye, I'm in by William Pikeland One. I'm not sure. I'm sorry if I said your name wrong. Yours effects, haha, Karmar, Draconic Fae, then Lorigan, then Eloy, then um, Totally Juvenile, then Tupelerchik, then then Puki Eleven. Hi and bye. I'm sorry, she can't. Uh huh. Uh, by John Twitch X and Pretty Darko Twitch and pretty much everybody who watch the stream warm late. Yeah, unfortunately you're pretty late. Um, I'll wait a little. So everybody have a wonderful rest of your day. Really hope you had fun. Um, yeah. I hope I will see tomorrow probably t early title Tuesday at 5 p.m. CT, 1 p.m. 1 p.m.? Yeah, 1 p.m. EST. Oh, no, wait, no, 11 a.m. Yeah, 11 a.m. I'll join tomorrow, all right, yeah. Take care. So, everybody, really hope you had fun stream. Have a great day. Have a good, a good one, yeah. Have a good one, everybody. Take care. Have a good one. And, yeah, thanks all for watching. I hope you had fun. And thanks all for watching. Peace, everybody, and bye-bye.